We're part of four Steeler playoff teams. Yeah. How different is Coach T in the playoffs versus the regular season? Bro, he's just more laser focused, right? But when you talk about Coach T, the thing that I do love is this. When we talk about the preparation and how you hear a guy say, oh, I'm really fired up this week. I'm really locked in this week. And it's like, well, dang, well, what about last week? What about the week before that? Coach Tomlin, that's his energy. He's like, bro, why do I have to get even more enamored this week than last week or the week before that? And that's why you hear the mantra, it's a five-star matchup because we're in it. It doesn't matter who we're playing. If we're playing, it's must-see TV. So that means you need to prepare. Like, it is must-see TV because nine times out of ten, what are teams showing up and doing? They're giving us their best shot, right? At least when we were here, that was the case. So that was the mindset. So when you get to the postseason, we over here like, bro, we ain't blinking. We already know what time we on. We already know. Each year you'd have whatever mantra it was. At one point we would talk about, you know, just being a pack of wild lions because we had to, you know, recover from uh, not having the best start of a season. All right. But whatever it may be, you know, that season we're talking about 15 pounds of meat, right? Because lines, wherever they go, it's like, man, they don't know where their food's going to come from, but they got to get 15 pounds of meat to survive. So I remember us literally take care of uh, Miami wild card round, right? Matt Moore gets killed. Shout out to Bud Dupree. Then after that, remember we go on that road. Chiefs. And we sit here like, okay, then switch the game. Kind of like how we talking about here. It was a little weird schedule and stuff. Hostile environment. Yeah, didn't that move the yep. game back uh -huh. at the day? Or yep. it to that night at least. They did. Mm -hmm. So we was like, all right, it did not matter. They got Tyree killed, man. This is the sensation returning the ball. Did not matter. 15 pounds of meat. That was the mindset. So for us, that's how it always is with Coach T, man. And that's why you love him because he already instills in you. It could be week one. This is the biggest game of the year. Why? Because it's the one we're in right now. This is the five-star matchup. Why? Because we're playing in it. Hey, who we got this week, it doesn't matter. Nameless, gray faces because he doesn't want you to allow your preparation to shift. And that's why when we talk about the whole Tomlin game vibe, I'm like, you heard Calvin also talk about players, right? It's like you're not going out on that field and not knowing what to do. You know every single thing this team is going to run. You know every single strengths, weaknesses, right? We come here and talk that. That's what we do in there. It's like, yo, what do they do well? What don't they do well? I want you to tell me about your opponent. Because if you don't know your opponent, what they do well and what they don't do well, how are you going to beat your opponent? So for him, you know, that's his mindset. So when you in here in postseason, bro, you just even more like that. It's just more cameras around. That's the other part. It's a ton more cameras around. But Coach T, he stays consistent through it all, man. But, yeah, you feel that. I mean, we all feel the same level of, we don't want to call it pressure because, I mean, technically there's pressure, right? That's this whole, you're either applying it or feeling it. So there's a buzz. I like to say it was a buzz because it's like, yo, you walking in when it's wild card weekend. And now instead of it just being your local beat writers and maybe one ESPN cat, now it's like, no, it's not the local ESPN dude. This is whatever headliner ESPN cat is here now. Oh, whoever is the main person for NBC, they here now. Oh, that's the ABC tower, they here now. Oh, that's this group's all, all ESPN people here. That's them right here now. Like, that's how it feels. So when you pulling up, you're like, bro, it's day gone, bro. It's just a, it's a Wednesday. What what we doing here on Wednesday, man? And that's the energy. That's what really creates that buzz or that pressure because you like, bro, you don't gotta tell me it's a big game. I'm pulling up and I'm seeing everybody that's national on TV in our locker room, bro. And they just want to talk to anybody that can get a chance to talk to. You're like, oh, okay. So this is this is a little this is a little bit different over here. They're trying to get a quick yeah. Sound, but. So that's the part where you're just like, man, you really lock in on your work, and that's the Coach T part, man. He call it elevated elevated music. So yo, it's elevated music. Just got to block it out, lock in. But that's him. Regular season, postseason preseason yeah even the otas we be mad sometimes like oh just otas bro it ain't that deep but that's legit for him man